Hi there and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to use Canva to record your screen. Quite simple if you know how. So first of all, get an account on Canva. Once you have an account, make sure that it's open. Next, you're going to go into the correct link, which is canva.com slash screen dash in the middle recorder. I'll show that in the uh, description of this video. Next, you're going to go into start recording. Now, it's really, really important that you follow these instructions. This is what you will get. You're going to go into record yourself. None of this is intuitive, so <laughs> stay tuned and follow. Next, if you want your camera, set up your camera. Once you do that, go into camera and screen. Make sure that you allow your audio and video if you wish to do that, or just your screen if you don't want to use your camera. Let's choose a screen. Now you can't choose from a Chrome tab or from any other browser tab. You need to go into a window. To make sure that you have everything open, I opened up, notice here on the right, new setting. I'm gonna click on that because that's what I wanna share. And notice it's not here, now it's here. But I need to go there in order to continue the screen sharing. But before I do that, I can either notice here, go into record. Let me take off the camera and just go for the screen. Going to go into record. And now it's getting ready to record. But I need to go there. So let me do that now. And here I am. This is my screen. And I'm going to show you a little bit about this site, which is called Integrating Technology, where you can get free online professional development courses. Notice here I can stop sharing here and the recording will stop. And then I'm going to go back into this tab, which is on my browser, and I'm going to go into done, or I can go into stop here, it's still going on. And then I'm going to save, this is the most important part, save and exit. Wait a few seconds and here it is. This is how it's done. Notice I need to give it a title, so I'll give it a title, toy, all right. And then um, I can play it or I can share. But the idea, of course, is to share it so I can upload it to either Google Drive, YouTube, or Vimeo. Notice the access doesn't really matter unless I want to share it and have others go through it. But I'm going to go to the download. Before I do that, I might want to change. Notice I can maximize it, make it larger. I can also add different things, which is nice. It's an editor. I can add text. I can add, notice here, remove the background. Everything is here, whatever is available on Canva, which is great. So I'm going to go, I can also play it here so you can see what it looks like. But the important thing is the share. You need to go into download and then notice here you can decide on the quality. It takes longer if you raise it. Okay, so I have 4K on my computer. You might not. And then you simply click on download and it'll be in your computer system. From there, you just simply share it on YouTube. That's one way of doing it. That's one share. Let me stop that. Another way to share, and notice there are a few here, you can make a public view link. Get a link and share it that way, which is just fine. Or you can go into other ways. You can embed it. Okay, there's the public view link. Make sure that you make it public before you do anything. And that's it. You can also present it straight from here. And then you also have a mouse here and you some really easy once you know how. Thank you for watching.